Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on, then. With pleasure. <laughs> Cloud? Is something wrong? It's nothing. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident, and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but... And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But... I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. No holding back. Allow me. Stay back! <laughs> 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 
holding back. Any time now. I see you. So long. You'll be blown away. Let's do this. Enjoy the ride. That's it. Sloppy. Here we go. Gotcha. Shit. Take the lead. Here goes. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Go on! Steady. <sighs> Hang back. Get ready. It's over. Let's go. Let us through, or else. Get him. Here we That's go. That's it. Here it comes. No holding back. Sloppy. So it's my turn? You'll feel it soon. Let's do this. Get him! Never again. I see you. Let's finish this. Feeling chilly? Get him! Not a guy! That's it! This one's for you! Was never in doubt. What's that? A big arm. Kinda cute, don't you think? Uh... Oh great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. I wonder if we can use this. Cloud! Here's an idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely! I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. You did it! Yeah. <laughs> uh... Hmm? Alright, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. Stop! Did we wake it up? Let's do it right. Don't catch a cold! <gasps> Feeling chilly? Don't open 
do it. I'll take care of them. Yeah. Need more magic. Go on. Someone blocked it off because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment. Healing chill. 
Looks like a dead end.
Hey, I bet you can grab that container with the arm. Not half bad. So do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? Yeah? Huh? Hmm. Oh no, look! Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. Okay, Cloud! Ready! Gotcha. Whoa, not too fast, okay? Got it. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? <clears throat> I need to get back. Besides... Looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit? Doing crimes? <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages. <laughs> Compliment and composite. I don't get it. Ah, how stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you get when you, uh, when somebody else. We haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. Okay, what do you want? Nothing.
nothing but our due recompense. That's all. <laughs> due recompense. Due recompense. What? Due, due recompense. Uh, no shit for brains. Due recompense. It's like uh, uh, uh it's like uh, 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 Compensatory damages. Damages recompense. I think we've heard enough. Too bad. This is gonna hurt. Soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. You're mine. You're burning up. Get fired up. 
keep it up. Right, my turn. Finish him off. Leave it to me. How shot? Come on. Stupid ladder is always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm. Got it?
down for you in a sec. Well, sure did. Uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just? Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for... there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! Time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? <sighs> so, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? 
The first guy I ever loved. What's his name? I probably know him. Uh, are you okay? Because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. Take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. Okay, getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer too. <laughs> Guess this is it then. Ready? Yeah. going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! No, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Come on! Okay. Come on, Cloud! We gotta hurry!
Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon, if at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Uh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Pharmacy, but we stock other stuff too. Thanks a bunch. Yeah, How'd you like a piping hot bun filled with the finest, most delicious, Cloud. and delectable? I will go wherever my taken. research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Cloud! I've come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Wow, I've registered a new summons battle intel request. Please, take a look. I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the materia. Ten gil an hour. I have no to tell food. you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new material. What lovely oh. life just beginning. Warmth, relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty here. ladies. Like oh, that's what I need. I got a place you're gonna love. I've done it again. Spent my whole day. It's a restaurant. One more drink. Oh, to enter or not to enter? That is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? Yeah, I should have figured. You're not the philosophical introspective type like me. That soft, naive face. I know you're kind well, bro. You're just another musclehead who uses violence to work through your inner demons. It's sad, really. Huh? Yeah, what's up? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Keep us here? Why? Tell me why! Oh, God, no. 
I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby. Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. My apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. Here we go again. One more. Let's run this place. Only a second. Yeah. Are you sure about this? Come on. Give it to me, please. Get away from me before I scream. Uh, that scent... I can't stand it. Welcome to Wall Market's premier weapon shop. Thank you. I hope to see you again soon. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the dumb's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is, hmm? Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! 
Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Hey, I'm talking to you. I said they're good. I'm saying they are. What are you thinking? Stupid, stupid, stupid. Crawl into a hole and die. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then, how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am! Heads! Huh? Hmm? Hmm. so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Step right up, step right up. Wait, wait. Think you're too good for my oh. I've done it again. Wait, wait, wait. It's supposed to go down this like the place? this. I think so. Just wanted to see Andrea. Let me handle this. You wait out here, okay? Then why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? <sighs> well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. <sighs> I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I've always wanted to dance for a living. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands are lifetime bands. Whoa. <laughs> Good.
Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. You nervous too? I know why you're here. Come on, old man. Maybe the breeze will keep it here a little longer. I can't believe I bought the same disc twice. Uh, excuse me. If you like, you can have it. <laughs> 